Yo, what's going on, guys? Uh, here again with another video. Well caffeinated, well rested, uh, well conceived, whatever the fuck it says. But I'm here to bring you the review of the uh, Haven Court slash Keezy TV hats. Um, I ordered these hats actually last month or this month, or whatever. Um, about sixty-five dollars. Shipped pretty quick, to be honest. I mean, I'm, I am based in Cali, so it, it right when I ordered it, like a couple days later, came to my house super fast. Um, I really loved it. I really loved it. I, oh, actually, no, I got it. I bought it last week. No, I bought it like two, three weeks ago. Um, it's a really nice hat. I'm gonna give you guys a review, the sizing, uh, quality, and all that stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll get started. So I went on store. He said he had a restock coming in, and I bought the LA fitted because I needed more LA fitted that weren't LA. You know, pretty pretty basic, I guess you could say. So it had and it has a nice little um, star loop thing on it, making me look like a Sailor Moon. But this is a dope quality hat. Um, I yeah, like I said, I didn't want any more of those basic LA hats because, dude, there's so many people coming up to me and being like, yeah, you a Dodgers guy. You, you, you Dodgers guy? What about the Giants? What's for the Giants? Like, dude, I'm just wearing a hat for stylish reasons. Um, they just look way better than, you know, buying other hats that say random things on it. Except for, like, trucker hats, though. I, I am trying to look for more trucker hats, but... Yeah, I decided, like, I needed a hat that, you know, has a design on it, at least so people could be not walk up to me and like, Oh, I guess he's not a baseball fan, you know? So, pretty dope hat. Uh, when it came in, a uh, nice little... When it came in, actually, I was really surprised how fast it came in. It came in like two days after I ordered it, and um, pristine condition. All, what the hell just fell? Um, pristine condition and everything. I like that it's not too high of a profile compared to like other like the 5950 hats from New Era, because they never fit my head shape a lot. I mean, it made me look like a little boy, and I did not like that look. So when these came in, I, I'm really happy with the shape that it came with um it's not too high of a bridge and yeah it's just a dope quality hat um i like the you know off i don't know how to describe this like coffee colored uh coffee dip colored guts and then the haven court lining it like you know words and all that stuff the quality is really good the quality i cannot complain about the only thing i complain about is this right here um it's not really centered too well but yeah i love this hat um I've been really needed more black hats. Uh, put this on real quick. Yeah, it's just dope. It did not come pre-bent. Uh, obviously, I had to um, add some rubber bands, steamed it up a little bit so it can fit a little nicer on, with my head. Um, I think the only thing that was a little bit more difficult for me because these are a lot harder cardboard than the uh, like regular 5950 hats from New, uh, New Era or like just regular hats from New Era in general. I feel like those are a little bit more malleable. Uh, they can bend a lot easier compared to this it not it's not really i guess it's just a, it is better quality but it was really hard to bend it to the correct uh kind of curve that i wanted to because like every single time i would add rubber band the do the rubber band trick to it it would just kind of go back into place it was super hard for me to get to this kind of perfect brim cur perfect curve to the brim so what i did was uh, i did the rubber band trick um i I had one giant rubber band, uh, twisted it around twice, and then I had another one because I feel like you think you're safe on how much you're bending it, but it, it kind of goes back to its shape pretty quick. So I would say over bend the brim because it is a lot of like a more harder cardboard. So I would like go like this much right here. I'll show you a video and it'll perfectly be like this. Obviously like for the, when you first take it out, it's gonna look kind of weird, but trust me, trust me, experience this enough uh, it will go back to that this shape which is perfect i love it i love it i still like um every tr every night try to add rubber bands to it just so it can stay in that shape and yeah that's like the only comp not a complaint but it is a lot harder cardboard than regular 5950s um i love like the profile of it the la logo is perfect uh, the only thing is, uh, I did get my size in a 714, like for the new era caps, and it fit a little bit roomier. I had to add like some napkins into it. Uh, obviously, the more you wear it, the more it's gonna shrink, like my penis. But um, I feel like I should size down a little bit. Maybe you know it's new era's fault for messing up the size, because you know new era it never like perfectly gets your size and stuff. So that's the thing, it had a lot of room. Uh, I'm just wearing it, I'm wearing like almost every day so it can shrink up. Uh, I love this hat, it goes great at everything. Um, got a lot of compliments from it. A lot of people 
in Seattle for some reason. They know about the hat a lot. They're always like, hey, it's that Keezy hat. <laughs> so literally, uh, really good investment hat. I would say fits nice, goes great with a lot of outfits. Quality's amazing, really amazing. I love it. And I like that it's a gray underbrim with like, you know, the, uh, I don't know how to describe that really, but the like the brownish guts inside it. Really dope hat. Good shit, Keezy. Haven Court. You did your thing on this hat, man. I'm telling you, you did your thing. Hopefully, I can cop like more hats in the future. I really want the bomber jacket that he's releasing. I feel like that's going to be super dope. Hopefully, I can get my right sizing because I don't want to look like a hand-me-down, like an older child. So, yeah. Uh, I'll show you a few fits with these. See how uh, like the side profile and all that stuff. Really dope, man. Like It has its own embroidery in the back, uh, the Haven Court logo. Super dope. Clean, clean hat like the sticker too I, I keep the sticker on the hat and let me know if you guys do that too because i don't know some people actually put it leave it on top some people leave it on the bottom some people leave it all around some people still have their tag on their shoes man and i don't know what to think about that so yes dope hat really really great quality is insane uh really great fitting uh it's not as high profile as uh you know new era 5950 so there you go new video posting more peace This is Pixie Opera Dogs.